Uh, Bass says, love the show. Here's my question. Installed Cool Iris in Firefox, and now every time I open a Firefox, it won't load. Just pops up for a second and is gone mm -hmm. again. Tried installing again, but still no success. Same thing keeps happening. Thanks in advance. Now, Thanks, are you Bass. are you watching the show? Uh, in, like, are you joining us in the chat room? Because what I need to know is just with your wording there. You installed Cool Iris in Firefox. And now every time I open Firefox, it won't load. Are we saying it Cool Iris won't load, or it Firefox won't load? I'm going to make the assumption that you're saying that Firefox won't load. Like you've installed this extension, now Firefox is broken somehow. Um, in that case, what you can do is you can bring up your places and your home folder. I'll just do this right on the screen. I don't have any in extensions installed on my system, but I'll show you how this is done. Go to your home folder and hit Control L. And when you're when you're hitting Control L, that's going to load. Uh, it's going to allow you to choose a location. So go to the end of that and go dot Mozilla. It, the dot means that it's a hidden folder, so you're not going to see it on your screen, but it's there. So when you go in there, you've got two folders. You've got extensions and Firefox, uh, and there's there's all different stuff that you're going to be able to. Um, that is stored in these folders. So for example, your, your internet favorites and stuff. So you don't want to just delete these folders because you don't want to lose your internet favorites, your bookmarks. Uh, but what you can possibly do is get into those extension folders, which for me are empty, but scroll around and get into the extensions folders and see if you can find the, uh, the extension that's, that's causing a problem and remove that. Alternatively, uh, it might be a good idea to just take, that, take these folders here. Okay, so with Firefox closed, here I am in .mozilla from my home folder. Just create a new folder called Backup and just grab all the other stuff that's in there and just drag it into that folder. So now you've got a backup copy of these folders, but the next time that you launch Firefox, it's not going to detect that the, uh, that the folders exist. So it's going to recreate uh, your Firefox uh, application settings for your user. So and then you can import your bookmarks and you can import the stuff from the backup folder. Might be an easier, quicker way to uh, to resolve the problem without having to try to find the right files to to move or remove. So just always keep a backup when you're messing with stuff like that. Very important because I don't want to see you lose any data or anything. So.